Yo, what's up guys? Toby here back with another video and today we are going to be taking a look at the AMD Ryzen 7 CPUs uh, benchmarks and performance numbers. These CPUs came out just a couple of weeks ago. There are three CPUs in this new lineup. It's the 1700 which I have here, it's the 1700X and it's the 1800X at the top line. So you might be wondering what's the real difference between these three chips? And the answer to that is there there are some minor differences between the three such as the X variants having the XFR feature enabled but you can kind of just mimic that by just overclocking the 1700. The big difference is clock speed where the 1700 has a base clock of 3.0 GHz and a boost of 3.7. The 1700X's base and boost are 3.4 and 3.8 and finally the 1800X has a base and boost clock speed of 3.6 and 4 GHz gigahertz respectively. So let's take a look at some benchmarks and see how these differences in clock speed turn out in the real performance of these three new AMD Ryzen CPUs. So as you guys could see in these benchmarks, the R7 lineup from AMD is very strong and if you are a person like me who both does creative work like video editing and plays games, these three CPUs are very good, especially the 1700. So yes, in my opinion, the R7 1700 is the better buy here because it's cheaper than the other two but you can overclock it to get the same performance. There are definitely a few things though that have to be sorted out over time. Software developers have to start optimizing their code for these new and very high core count CPUs. But yes, I am very happy with my new AMD Ryzen 1700 and I think that you would be too. So if you are interested in buying any of these new chips, there will be some links down below to Amazon.com if you click those and purchase something that helps me out a lot. Make sure to tell me what you guys think of these new CPUs down below in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.